Okay. It's a reflect. Do you so, have an ID on you? Do I need an ID? Yes. For what? What crime oh, have I committed? They identified you. You just identified yourself as being over there. On the sidewalk. I'm investigating. Okay. What crime? This is. What crime? Possible right, trespass. Right, right. Now you're redirecting against my question of. I don't have to answer your question. Reasonable, articulable suspicion of a crime. I was standing on that sidewalk. I'm only going to ask you one more time. And then Go I'm ahead. I'm just going to have to cuff you up, man. I don't want to do that. Can you get your like supervisor out here, please? Well, I don't like your, your movement, so I'm going to What I'm doing? You. What's going on, everybody? And welcome back into the Surreal Cam channel. Folks, fasten your seatbelts because I got a mind-blowing ride for you on this one. Which is exactly why I wanted to highlight this video and this new channel, Kansas City Accountability. Which this was this man's second video. And let me tell you, what he goes through here is absolutely bizarre. I don't want to take up too much of your time here. I do want to get this started fast, but I do want to give you a quick rundown about this video because it's almost an hour long on this man's channel, which I'm going to just break it down for you here on my video. This man is out doing some public photography on a public sidewalk. This man has the camera pointed at a bank which apparently the employees in there have an extremely bad issue with him pointing the camera at the building. So of course, they end up calling the Kansas City Police Department. Now let's pay close attention now on how they handled this situation. Let's go take a look, shall we? They did call the cops. Hey man. How's it going? Uh, what's man, your name I'm and your badge number? Uh, Officer Bremer. Bremer. And what's your name and badge number? Long story short, it sounds like whatever you were doing at the bank, they don't want you to be over there. I anymore. was on the public sidewalk recording. Okay, well, they said it, whatever you were doing, they just don't want you over there. Anymore. I was on the public sidewalk. They can't tell me not to be on yeah, the public I don't sidewalk. Know, man. I know, I, I'm just, you, you want to you go over there? No, not really. We can go over there. Uh, and... I didn't, th I told them they came outside. Let me calm down. They came outside. The guy, Aaron, he said, hey, what are you doing? I said, I'm an independent journalist. I'm just gathering content on the story. I was walking all the way up down Truman and I walked down there to record the train. And then the lady came out, she said, hey, you can't record the bank. I said, ma'am, I'm on public property. So- Yeah, but you could see why that, that would kind of make them uncomfortable, right? You, I mean, it's a bank. You can't even see nothing. I, I know, but they don't know that. Yeah, you can. If you stand outside and you look at the bank, you yeah. can't see anything. The windows is tinted. It's okay. a reflect. Do you so, have an ID on you? Do I need an ID? Yes. For what? What crime uh, have I committed? They identified you. You just identified yourself as being over there. On the sidewalk. I'm investigating okay. what whatever crime? this is. What crime? Possible right, trespass. Right, right I was on the sidewalk. Okay, I was how are you gonna trespass me and I'm on the sidewalk? Because they're saying you were on the property. I got camera footage. Now and if they lie to you and I show you that they're lying, are you gonna do something that's, to them? That's that's on that's between you and them. Oh okay. no, that's Somebody over there is lying. I'm on the public sidewalk. I came all the way up Truman. I walked down there to get the footage of the train. On my way back, I just looked. I just looked at the. I just looked at the bank, and they came running outside. So, I, yeah, came back over here, walked there, about to go to work. Okay, so I need right No, sir. I do though. No, you do not. For what crime? I just told you they put a call on you. I wasn't. I was on you the. I, and I wish. I wish I was there. still on that sidewalk when you when you pulled up. I wish I was on the sidewalk. I was right here, sir. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, no, I'm not so obligated. No, 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 no. I'm not obligated to give you my you ID. I just told you. Because I haven't committed no crime. No crime was committed, sir. Brother, is your tags aren't coming back on file. It's absolutely pathetic, it's mind-blowing, and I just don't understand how cops in this day and age can be so stupid on simple, simple laws and the oath they swore an oath to. So apparently this cameraman had no idea that the bank people called the cops on him. He was parked somewhere across the street as he was getting in his vehicle. The cops had pulled up on him. And for this being his second video, I think he's doing a great job here. After you're done watching this, don't forget to click the link down below in the description and go subscribe and show him some credit and support and let him know I sent you. Let's get him to a thousand subs. Okay, for the Kansas registration, do you have the registration paperwork for it? 
You can hold your phone up and zoom. No, it's okay. No, I'm, I'm trying to be. Asking you a legitimate question. Do you have the registration for the vehicle? <laughs> hey, you guys. So this is this this is when, and I had my uh, I had my selfie stick out when I was recording. I was on the public okay, side. You're, now you're redirecting against my question of. I don't have to answer your question. I asked you if you have the registration information for your vehicle that you drove here on I, Missouri roadway I, that is unregistered this, as of right now. Now it doesn't go ahead. through our system. We ran it through, through out of Kansas. Go ahead. Now we need to verify to make sure. So that's why I'm asking you if you have the paperwork. You didn't see me drive the car. How else did you get here? It don't matter. How else did you it, get here? it don't matter, sir. It does. It, 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 it does. And if you see that, that came from a uh, that came from a dealership. Yes, you're right. Wanting to give us your no, listen. If, if if no, listen. If I committed a crime, I will give you my ID. That's what be. That's what reasonable, articulable suspicion of a crime. I was standing on that sidewalk, sir. Why would you try to infringe on my rights? Okay, so let, let me let me get this straight. So Why would you try to infringe on my rights, uh, Mr. Stand, Brimmer? You're gonna stand outside of a bank. No, I walk. I, I heard you. Okay. So you're going to stand outside of a bank every okay. day videotaping the bank and you don't think that's going to make the employees extremely uncomfortable. See, where they get because uncomfortable... You're in the inner city. Listen, oh, do, you, do you stay in Kansas? Their uncomfortability don't, right, don't stop my right. You're in the inner city right. of KCMO, okay? So that makes, uh, that makes most businesses extremely uncomfortable. And what's up with your buddy, man? So now that you've identified yourself now as the one being said or one standing, standing on the, on the sidewalk and videotaping them and making them feel no i came to, to re issue the verbal warning no listen which is what we're trying to do so we can send you a bunch of way no. you're refusing to give her no 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 that, no what happened so is i'm only going to ask you one more time and go ahead i'm just going to have to cuff you up man and i don't want to do that can you get your like supervisor out right here please yeah, can you get your supervisor please because i was on the sidewalk You know what I would have liked to, to, to happen when you guys pulled up and they called you guys? Hey, where was he standing there? Was he on you guys' property? You should have... You, what I would have liked is, sir, when you pulled up and they told you what happened, hey, he was on the sidewalk, he has every right to record on the sidewalk. I wasn't even coming to the bank. I was coming to get the train. Uh, there's officers that monitor the city cameras that saw you forbade them on their property. <laughs> That's a lie. It's in the, it's in the corner. Okay, do you, do you want me to stop this video and show you? No, I would like to get your information so I could issue the verbal warning and send you about your way. I wasn't on their property. That's how trespass work. Trespass, if you're on the property, they tell you to leave. That's how it go. They give you a chance to leave, you're and then you're trespass. And they don't know that you have a selfie stick. Why would citizens that are probably unarmed come and, uh, and approach you? I honestly don't understand how these two boneheads got hired. This cameraman is offering him to show him the footage off his video camera. And of course, he doesn't want to see it. He doesn't want to see the real true evidence. He's still fiending for that identification. Why? Because he's holding up what kills careers, a camera. Why? You, okay, so first off, you're videotaping, you're standing outside, you're being extremely suspicious. They can't tell that that's a selfie stick. Why would citizens? They can't tell. It was, it was like this. Are you going to ask me a question and then not let me? It, I was like, they came, Aaron came outside and talked to me. We had a good dialogue. We had a good dialogue. That's not what the lady on the phone said to put in the call about you. I can show you the video. Do y'all want me? Y'all want to see the video? No, I'd like to get your information so I can send you away. For reasonable, articulable suspicion I just did. I, of I a gave crime. You, all the reasonable, you you reasonable did not, sir. I'm just wait. Let's just wait for the super. Let's just officer. see what the supervisor say when he get here. This is wild. Okay. Well, I don't like your your movement, so I'm gonna. What I'm doing? You. I don't. Uh, you keep backing away from. No, the no, I'm not doing anything. Really suspicious. Why are y'all taking my cat? Y'all gonna stop my video? Down. I'm not no, going anywhere. Rest. Now pay close attention now what these cops make this man do. Sit down like a dog and cross his legs because it's policy while he's handcuffed. Forcing him to sit. And that's including all the trash garbage that comes out of this cop's mouth. But you keep backing up towards the road, and I don't like that. No, I'm not going anywhere. And, right. and the fact that you're refusing to, to give us any sort of information... I'm just gonna sit you on the curb, brother. Okay. Reach, reaching into your pocket. Ain't nothing in my pocket. I, I don't like all the jets. Can I get my, can I, can I hold that please? No. Okay. Over here at the corner.
Okay, I'll just put it on the head. Yeah. They, can, they said we can get a car to it out here. What's the moment? Why don't we do it? Check out our real estate. Can I please stand? No, I'd like it. <laughs> What am I, I mean, tough. I'm not, ain't nothing in my pocket. My portable charger, you pat me down. Come on, pat me down. I have nothing on me. I have my portable charger. Are you giving me consent to search your person? No, sir, man. Can I stand? No, you cannot have a seat. Come on. Wash your ankles, partner. This is, for a policy, when we sit you down, you need to kick your legs out and cross them. Oh, my God. So are you going to refuse another lawful order? Is that, I'm not is that refusing. What I'm and first of all, you got me detained yes, for what correct. crime? I'm on a public sidewalk. This is this illegal entering. detainment. And this this is an illegal detainment. And I literally just said that I would like to so, let you so go. This is a, this, this is, is the illegal. Way that you, this is illegal. Well, you keep cutting me off. But the way that you are acting. As of right now, we've given you multiple commands and you're not abiding by them. I don't have to sir. follow your commands if I haven't committed a crime, sir. You don't have to follow... Not if I haven't law. committed no crime. When It's not lawful if I haven't committed a crime. It's not lawful if I haven't committed a crime. Public, public photography? You know the plain view doctrine? You can't trespass my eyes. Anything I see I'm in public... That, 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 listen, sir, I literally plan. gave you more than enough, even just reasonable suspicion for them to believe that there's some some sort of strangeness going on here. Strange. Is strange a misdemeanor or a uh, I believe it'd be a misdemeanor. <laughs> wow. I was going to go get the train. Until they stopped me. They did good because they didn't try to, you know, force me. Hey, you can't record. Well, the lady said that, and I was like, Hey, ma'am, I'm on public, I'm on public sidewalk. Seems like you just want to be confrontational. No, sir. Listen, did you call me off guard because you are a law enforcer, not a feelings enforcer. So if they feel this way and feel that way, you, we can't go on feeling. You are a law enforcer. If you enforcer. can't remotely pass through or fathom why it would make inner city folks or of any sort of business uncomfortable that a male they don't know is outside videotaping what at least what appears to be videotaping their business especially when it's a bank public, i don't know what to tell you public you can't tell me you can't look me in the eye and tell me that wouldn't make anybody upset or at least at least a little and, 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 suspicious you, you i don't want to bush Bremer. so mr Bremer. Yes. I get what they're saying, that they feel nervous, suspicious, whatever going on. But they came outside and had a dialogue with me. I not, told them Not exactly. the lady that we are, were on the phone with. I got it recorded on my phone. I, and that might be the case, brother, but that, that that's not who you talk to. Or that's not who talked to us. Well, listen, a gentleman and a lady came out the bank to speak with me. Uh-huh. We talked to a lady. We haven't seen her. Listen, long, it, okay, the guy named that came out and talked to me, his name is Aaron. The other lady, the black lady that came out, she didn't want to give me her name. But I let them both know, hey, I'm an independent journalist. I'm just gathering content for a story. I came to get the train. She said, hey, you can't record the bank. I said, well, who told you that? What made you think that? I'm on a public sidewalk. So then I did point my camera at the bank. to Like, I can't record on the sidewalk. But I came intentionally to come get this train right here. You were about to leave when we walked out. You said what? You were about to leave when we walked out. Yeah. The train just came. I got the train. Do you want to see my footage? I no, bro. It. I'm just asking, bro. I like. I, we've literally been sitting here, and it just passed. I already got the train. I got three times the train. I mean, I'm sure by. there's more than yeah, one train, yeah, but like. Mr. Bremer, come on, man. You enforcing You made it seem like it was this. Bro, you enforcing feelings. No, bro. I'm not trying no, to force I'm good, you. Man. I'm trying to send you a bunch of way. When'd you get your vehicle? Enforcing feelings. <laughs> That's wild. Law enforcement enforcing feelings. What's the law? Hey man, it's 2024. We're out here for everybody's feelings. The law for feelings. To detain someone. Okay, sir. So, you were on the sidewalk during that point. I want to tell you that. But you were also in the grass area. No, I wasn't. I yes. got it on 
at least I can't so you, were, you were on no, the ground? No, I was never on the ground. Area. I know okay. the law. This is what I do. She, I'm an independent okay, while, attorney, sir. She talked to you in, in, while while you were in the grass I area. wasn't in the grass. Yeah. I'm on the sidewalk. Which is, which is their, their property, okay. which I understand. Let you talk. But I am going to issue you a trespass warning. Okay, I with a trespass warning, it's right. not a charge. It's just saying that you cannot be trespassed. Yeah. You know the guy that knows the law. That's the captain, but he, he'll probably tell you the same thing. Okay. And what's his name? Captain Clark. Captain Clark? Yes, yes. sir. Yeah. You want to talk to him? The calling party saw talked to him on the grass. I was never on the grass, sir. Yeah. 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 How you doing, Captain Clark? Hi, how are you? How you doing? I'm okay. My, na my name is Moses. I'm an independent journalist. I'm just gathering Mission. content for a story. Okay. I was walking up the sidewalk, and as I came up That's the fine. sidewalk, you, I saw the trains going by. Okay. So I'm only on the sidewalk. I know my I know my rights and what I can do. I went over to record the train. On my way back, the people came out the bank and said, hey, what are you doing? His name is Aaron. I said, hey, Aaron, my name is Moses. I'm an independent journalist. I'm gathering content for a story. That's it. He said, well, what's your story about? I said, I can't tell you. He said, why can't you tell me? I said, it compromises the story. It's not published yet. So then the uh, the black lady came out and she said, hey, you can't record the bank. I said, well, what would make you say that? I'm on, I'm on the public sidewalk. She said, you just can't record the bank. And then I just started pointing my camera towards the bank. I was standing there about maybe about 10, 15 minutes. They never bothered me again. I said, okay, I'll give you guys a pass. I walked off. Walked off. I walked over here. Yes. I walked over here. I got everything on camera, too. Okay. I can okay. show you. All right. Well, I tell you what. Uh, and he, and they he they call it so there's cameras everywhere in mm -hmm. here. So you were, you were, you were, the easement right there is the sidewalk, but the grassy area, I was it actually belongs to the, I okay. Well, here, here, here's, here's, here's the thing. So does the bank want to do anything? They, they can't huh? trespass me. I was on the sidewalk. Did you trespass me? I was on the sidewalk. Okay. You can't trespass me from public property. Plain view doctrine. Okay. Can't trespass what? my eye. What, what Anything you, what, I see him. What was your first name? Moses. My Moses. name is just calling me Moses. Sorry. So I don't have to. So I'm, you guys okay if I stand him up? And, and, and Moses won't stand up. So I went off to. And I have okay. And I have no ill intent. I have okay. nothing on me. Step like, up here that way. We don't have to. Yes, have sir. To, you don't have to look straight yeah, up. Yes, sir. Me. I already sent you home, man. You think you can tag him for the coach? <laughs> well, he's, he's about to tell him the same thing he told you. Okay. But John. Verbally trespass somebody we don't know. You can't trespass with your eyes. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Plain view you know, doctrine. You know, just there. Plain view yeah. doctrine. You seem, I'm going to be honest with you, you seem well versed in certain things, but not like everything. No, this is what I do. That's what I'm going to hear you. I don't believe we you. Always, I'm not we we, we only yeah. talking about the First Amendment now, man. We only talking about the First Amendment. I, I understand. I have freedom of the press. Anything I see in public, I can record. Now, you record somebody in public, they may be like, hey, I don't want you to record me. I didn't give you consent. I don't need consent in public. In public. Well, I'm just asking out of curiosity then, because I don't know the, uh, the, uh, the publisher side of this. So when you, no, well, hold on. So when you, when you, like when they have these, I don't know, let's say cops. You're watching cops. Yeah. And then like there's people with blurred out faces. Don't they have yeah. to sign a consent? Not the gun. Okay. Well, okay, like, I'm just so, saying the so, scenarios so, so, in public. Okay, let me give you a scenario. You at Disney World. You take a kid to Disney World. Yeah. You ready to take a picture? You gonna make everybody in the back sign, in the back in the background of your picture sign up? Well, I mean, but that's not broadcasting it. I'm just asking because you're not broadcasting it on. Uh, <laughs> Like public television, you know what I'm saying? Like that's like a personal use picture. Like yours is, well, I don't know what it exactly. Is. Look at this. They taking cuffs off me. Yeah, I told you you were detained. <laughs> Illegal. <laughs> now you just been. He illegally cuffed me. And oh, that's our sergeant. That's the sergeant? Yeah. Hey, how you doing, sergeant? Good, how you doing, man? What's your name and your badge number, sir? Uh, Sergeant Porter, 5382. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, again, just to give you a little quick rough draft on what just took place here, man. Uh, I'm an independent journalist again. I'm just gathering content for a story right before work. I'm a government employee as well. Uh -huh. I got sworn in. I work right there. So before I came here, 
I park right here, I walk down there just so I can get a nice good footage of the train. Uh -huh. And I seen I had a sidewalk where I can get over there to the yeah. gate. Uh -huh. So I walked up to get the train, and on my way back, the people in the bank came out. His name is Aaron. I spoke to Aaron, said, hey, my name is Moses. Uh, I'm an independent journalist, just gathering content for a story. Another lady came out and said, hey, you can't record the bank. I said, well, ma'am, I'm on a public sidewalk. You know, she said, you can't record the bank. So I did just stand there and record for, you know, about 10 minutes or so, just to prove a point that I can not record. I walked off, came over here to get a drink. As I'm stepping in the car, these fine guys pulled, and I seen several cops rolling by. They even waved at me. I even got it on camera. And then these guys pulls up, you know, I turn my camera back on, hey, how you guys doing? And let them know what happened. And then he just started saying, hey, where's your ID? Uh, I'm renting your tags, you got registration. It just seemed like you just was like, just digging, just want to arrest me, man. I have That's no ill against you, brother. I've weird told something. Here's the deal. They got called. The reason why everyone went by, they're the ones who got called. The other ones did. So right. they already responded to a call. I get it. Right. You're right. You're on the sidewalk. You ain't breaking any law. So they they claim you're on their property. Obviously, just so you know, you're not allowed on their property. If you're on yes, the property, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I do this you for a living. I'm an independent journalist. You know what I'm saying? Well, independent journalist. No, you can't be on the private property. I wasn't. I, no, I was never on the property. I, though. You know. You know what I'm saying? And, and that's fine. I mean, if they uh, they, like they said they were. It's okay. It, it, you're but, allowed, you're, and, I mean, you were you were there freely. Yeah. They warned you, don't go back. So yeah. Now you've been warned, don't go back on their property. I, I was never on it, but again, um, they were responding to a call. That's all they were doing. Just, just what, what, what kind of? Well, I want to say kind of like just bother me is uh, how you pronounce your name? What's your name and badge number? Cordova. Cordova. And this is all just a learning experience. You know what I'm saying? I never knew how long you've been on the force, and sometimes you never come into a situation like this. But once I told you what took place. You were still pushing the issue. I said, hey, sir, you said they're trying to trespass you. I'm like, I never was on their property. It's the plain view doctrine. Whatever I see in public, I can record. You can't trespass my eyes, man. That's all. Okay. So, you're getting information on what on other events. So but I even asked you, do you, I said, I'll stop my camera and I'll show you. You said, no, I don't want to see it. You just took that. I never said that. I got it on camera. Man, this, the story going to love it, man. It's on camera. Do you need anything else? I don't need anything else. You did. You did great, man. One more time, because they're gonna highlight you in the uh, in, in the in the footage. One more time. One more time. What? Five six five, Mr. Oh, Porter. Oh, Five three eight two. Mr. Porter, man, I appreciate him. Is it your vehicle, though? It no, it's because my mother. We're not gonna make a big deal, but obviously, that being broken is illegal. So make sure you get that fixed, okay? Yes, sir. All right. Yes, sir. Do you have any other questions for me? I know you, man. You did great. I'm, I'm glad you came on the scene. That's why when, when they came, and it's, I can tell a lot of, when you run into officers, sometimes they're not used to the recording. And people saying, hey, I don't want to be recorded. So instantly, I said, just let's just get a supervisor. Because I know the supervisor. And that's fine. You can always have Yeah, like, yes, sir. They're, like, they're responding. Their, their side was that you were trespassing. And that's all they were investigating. Oh, uh, yeah. Right. Well, I appreciate you guys, man. You got anything else for me? And no, nothing, right, well, man. Get out of here, sir. Yeah, I have a great day. Yes, sir for being this man's second video and for facing tyranny the way he just did i think he did a fabulous job and he killed it freedom is scary and it's not easy folks this man is also a public employee so let's go ahead and hop on his channel and don't forget to subscribe if you like this type of content and show him some support and don't forget to let him know that the surreal cam sent you his channel link once again will be pinned down in the comments and in the description and you know I want to see you in the comment section as well. And let me know what your thoughts are about this video and what you think about these Kansas City road pirates that we pay, folks. That we pay. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you smash that subscribe. Smash the bell for first notifications. Of course, everyone hit the like button. Trolls, haters, smash the down. Help out my channel with the algorithm. And you know... We'll see you on the next video soon.